Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make this beautiful romantic beaded bracelet. It's really easy to make and I'll show you step by step with one needle technique and I'm sure by the end of this tutorial you're going to be able to make it by yourself. I use really simple materials and this is a beginner's level tutorial. So if you want to support me and see more and more videos like this, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh bidding ideas and you could also like, share and comment. You don't know how much you help me only with this action and if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. You could also check my St. Valentine's playlist here at the eye icon. So down there in description you will find the full list of materials, Amazon links where you could buy supplies from, link to my store and link for PayPal donations to develop this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Now I will start with the list of the materials. Okay guys, so what I'm using for this video are 11 seed beads in this beautiful silver color and I also use 3 mm pearls and 4 mm pearls in green and pink and here I use lobster's claw clasp and a jump ring, you could use any type of clasp you like. Uh, this is monofilament that is 0.006 inches or 0.15 mm, you could use some other beading thread of your choice. This is size 10 beading needle, scissors and you could use pliers, flat nose pliers but they are not obligatory only if you need to go through the difficult beads okay and now i'm going to take about an arm span of thread on my needle and i'll be back okay guys and now i have an arm span of thread on my needle and what i'm going to do is pick up six of these beautiful beads okay and i have my six beads here and i'm going to slide those down I will stick my needle in my mat and here what I want to do is make a knot and I will make my knot by making here a loop going twice or three times through the loop I've made, pull. Then I will make one more knot and this is a really secure surgeon's knot or half hitch knot. Okay and now I'm going through some beads in this direction and what I want to do here is take one of my green pearls okay I'm taking it and I will take one silver bead as well I'm going to slide those down here next to my work just like this and I'm going to skip this silver bead and go here in the next silver of my circle okay now I have this okay and what I want to do is go around my circle here of beads and exit one more time here at this silver Okay, and I'm exiting here out of the silver bead and what I'm going to pick are one pink, one silver, one pink, one silver, and then one green and one silver. Okay, so this is what I'm picking up and slide it down. Okay, I have this and now I'm going to repeat this one pink one silver one pink one silver one green one silver okay this is what I have on my needle and I'm sliding it down okay I will show you third time one pink, one silver, one pink, one silver, one green, one silver. Okay, third time. 
this is the third time okay and I'm going to repeat this 10 times until my green beads are over okay I'll do this off camera and I'll be back okay guys and now I have this repeated until my green beads are over all of the 11 green beads okay and now what I'm going to do is you see here I have one silver bead and I'm going to skip it and go through the green and through the following pink you see where I'm exiting and pull and now guys I'm here at the pink one I'm exiting after this pink if you don't see my thread and I'm going to take two silver beads and go through the next pink through the green and if you can exit out of the next pink okay and pull and when I pull I have this then in my next step I'm going to take two silver beads just like this and go through the pink through the silver and exit out of the next pink one okay I'm exiting here out of the next pink and when I pull I have this triangle here okay then I'm going to take two more beads and as I'm exiting from this pink I'm going through the following pink and if you can you could go out through the next pink in one movement but if it's difficult for you do it or two or three movements it doesn't matter that much okay now take two and do this again go through the following pin and exit out of the next pink okay just like this and pull gently because your thread is still really long okay and now I'm going to continue this and when I'm up to this part here I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next okay guys and see where I am I am here where my last pink beads are okay and I want to put two silver beads here okay and I'm going through this pink one through the silver and after that through this green one okay and I will make one for full circle around these silver beads here okay guys and now I'm here and in my next step I will go here between the these two silver beads that I added last I'm going through the first of them okay now I'm exiting between them in the center and I will take just one silver bead like this and go here through this silver and through the following pink bead here okay and when I pull I have this okay now guys I'm going to take one silver one pink four millimeter and one silver okay this is what I have and I'm going here through this pink one and through all of my beads in this direction okay going here then I want to go through all of those beads in this direction okay pull tight make it tight okay then I'm going through this pink and through the first silver of the two that I added in my last row 
and I'm going to take one silver I go through the following silver and also I go through this pink bead okay now I'm going to do the same thing I'm taking one silver one of these beautiful four millimeter beads and one silver okay this is what I have and I'm going back through this pink one here back in circle okay pull now I have this then I'm going here through these two silver beads and the pink one and if you can go in one movement through the following pink and I'm going to repeat this one more time exiting here out of this silver taking one silver exiting out of the pink oops I went also through this silver I will go back here I went too far okay now guess what I take a silver a pink and a silver okay and I'm going back in circle through this one here okay and now guys I'm going to continue this until the end of this row and when I'm ready I'll be back to tell you how to finish your bracelet okay guys and when I continue beading this is what I have and here I just added my last pink pearl okay and now guys what I'm going to do is go here at the back at the end of my bracelet okay I'm going through the green pearl and also here at the end okay and here what I want to take are two silver beads then I'm going to take my clasp and two more silver beads okay this is what I have on my needle and as I'm exiting from this silver bead I'm going back in circle through it okay just like that now I'm going to reinforce it and make some knots okay guys and I'm here where I want to make a knot and in order to make a knot I make here a loop and I go once and I go second time through this loop I've made and I pull then what I do is that I go through the following bead I could repeat this knot several times and when I'm ready I will go through the following seed bead and cut my thread okay guys and now my romantic beaded bracelet is ready 
Okay guys, and now my romantic beaded bracelet is ready. So if you like it and you want to see more and more Saint Valentine's tutorials, please stay with me and subscribe and also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action. And if you make beautiful jewelries following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. Down there in description, you will find a full list of materials Links where you could buy supplies from link to my store and link for PayPal donations to develop this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye from me.